Poland has been sharply criticized for influencing the judiciary. The EU Commission is now demanding a high fine. If it is not settled, a step unprecedented in the EU will follow. So the EU Commission is demanding that Poland pay a fine of almost 70 million euros for disrupting the judiciary in the member country. As announced on Thursday from EU circles in Brussels, the Commission is reacting to the fact that Poland has not stopped the activities of the disciplinary chamber of its Supreme Court. The body is accused of undermining the independence of the Polish judiciary. The Commission reportedly sent Poland a, lent a letter on Wednesday demanding the payment of 69 million euros within 45 days. I can confirm that the letter was sent, said the Commission spokesman to the AFP news agency without giving details. At the end of October, the European Court of Justice, the ECJ in Luxembourg, ordered Poland to pay a fine of 1 million euros a day from November 3rd for its actions in the matter. This is intended to enforce a previous emergency decision by the ECJ ordering an immediate halt to the activities of the disciplinary chamber of Poland's Supreme Court. The now requested sum of 69 million euros covers the fine that has accumulated up to January 10th. If Poland does not pay the claim within 60 days, the amount can be deducted from EU payments to Poland. Such a step would be unprecedented, but it also threatens Poland in other proceedings. It is about Warsaw's refusal to pay 500,000 euros a day as ordered by the EU because it does not close a huge lignite quarry. In this case, the EU Commission has already demanded an advance payment of 15 million euros from Warsaw. And the one with the bigger purse is the one on the longer end of the stick, I guess. I'll see you in my next video. Bis gleich.